Hi there, welcome to another program of 1010 Replaying. This is a weekly feature you've been looking at us for the past weeks on this television program, bringing you up to date with some of the major activities surrounding the 1010. At the Everest Ground, we launched the 1010 tournament officially for 2012. Okay, over the next half an hour or so, I'll be uh, filling you in on some of the details of what happened on last Saturday. My name is Naeem Chen. I'm going to be here for the next half an hour or so. And during that time, I'll be talking with people like Leonard Harper Shad from the uh, Guyana Softball League to hear exactly what transpired. And I'm talking here about the legit or the legitimacy of the matches and all the legalities and ramifications from an operations point of view. I'll also be talking uh, with Mr. Richard Subdale, he's the project manager for the uh, 2012 tournament. You'll be hearing from the perspective of the sponsors uh, who have teamed up together. So as I said, it all culminated, all the preparations culminated on Saturday at the Everest ground. Now, before the first game was played off, we had to, uh, we had a simple but short but uh, simple ceremony uh, ceremonial bowl off so to speak and at that ceremony we heard a few comments from Mr. Richard Subdeo he's the project manager we also had Mr. Royston Rajpal he's the chief financial officer of GT&T and of course uh, the permanent secretary from the Ministry of Sport and Culture let's go back to that tape welcome to the official GT&T 1010 Softball Cricket 2012 Tournament, Bolo. GTT 1010 was launched in 2010. This is our third year, consecutive year of hosting this tournament. It has grown to the extent that it's been touted as one of the best events ever to be hosted in Guyana, a cricket tournament that is. This year we have a final count of teams of 942, of which 117 teams are female. So it's a fantastic number of people. If you take that by 14 players, there's over 13,000 players that is taking part in this wonderful tournament. The ministry, of course, is indeed proud of gt ts involvement in promoting sports, recognizing, of course, the strength of sports and of course what it can do for bringing our communities and our people together. I want to wish you all well. May the best team win. The SUV that you see there, uh, the players, we are already giving $30 million in cash and prizes to the teams that are competing. This wonderful SUV that you're looking at is for the fans. So those of you in the pavilions and the fans countrywide, this vehicle is for one of you guys. I want to encourage you to text this promotion. It's a texting promotion. So you text the word register to 6203788. And thereafter, we will follow through with questions based on the tournament from 2010 today. You got to know that come in 63 days' time, some lucky fan out there that has been following our tournament over the last two years and this year included uh, will be able to drive away this beautiful uh, Toyota Tacoma pickup in 63 days time. I'll say 63 days uh, tomorrow. I might, if you interview me again, I'll have it for 62 days. But it's good to know that some lucky fan out there will be winners. At least they are a part. They are the one that come and support these games. So we felt it that we should give something to these guys. Well, there you had it, the formalities before the official um, game started in 2012. Okay, this all happened on the Everest ground. But when we come back after the commercial break, you'll be seeing interviews, the SUV promotion draw. You'll be having highlights of uh, all the t uh, games that were played across the country, some of them at least, where our cameras were able to meet. Okay, after the commercial break. <laughs>
win this fully loaded customized SUV with Lamborghini doors from GTNT. Text register to 6203788 to answer four questions. Every four questions answered correctly gives you a coupon to win this magnificent ride and many other prizes. Answers are in the GTNT Stanton Magazine 2012 edition. Get yours today. More coupons, more chances to win. So keep texting. GTNT Tantan. It's our game. See press for details. Well, as we said earlier, on all the preparations were there over the past weeks. All the players have been pumped up. The enthusiasm was there. The excitement started to build. The crowds were uh, beginning to fall into the stands and the picnic atmosphere was taking shape. Now, just before the tournament started, we had to have a little feel of what the players themselves feel about the 2012 tournament. Louis Max was the man there to chat with them. I'm with Team Regal right now, one of the teams participating in this year's stance and one of the leading teams here with me is Mr. Kingston. Mr. Kingston, what is the uh, feeling in the camp right now? Uh, the feeling is very high, very positive going into this game. I'm very confident. This year's tournament, I know you were, you made it into the final round of 16 on the last two occasions. Do you think you could take it all the way to the end this time around? Well, there's a main objective. The main objective is to carry on the trophy this year. Last time we spoke, you said you've lost one of your players to the Warriors and you've replaced him with somebody equal as equal as him. Who's that person? Um, that person is, is, is no other than Patrick Ruplan from Esquibo. Right. That's leaving the Ireland in Esquibo. What, what caused the switch? I just want to develop the cricket. A little more. Uh, because Esquibo don't get no big game, you know, response or anything. I don't develop the cricket a lot. All right, well, Regal, we want to wish you guys all the best. You on first this afternoon. I hope we see you at the stadium come May 12th. More popular on the dance stage, but this year he is in the GTT 1010 softball tournament. Kerry Book, you the name of this team? Um, our name of the team is uh, Swing Phoenix College Police Team. Oh, this is the, the police team. Great. Uh, no, this is not your first year then. You've been in this tournament before. Yeah, we was in it last year. Great. Well, what was the uh, success last year for the police team? Okay, the success for us last year, we reached almost to the final 16 and we lost in that match. Any changes to the team this year? Yeah, we have a lot of changes, a lot of um, new persons from in the team that was um, really all around us. We could bowl, bat field and everything. So we're coming a bit stronger this year and we're we hoping to win this year. Who you, who, which team are you coming up against first today? We're coming up against Tocqueville team. Oh, the Tocqueville, great. Well, we're Kerry, we want to wish you all the best. This is GTT's 1010 2012 Softball Cricket Tournament. There we had a word with the Divas team as they were going through their paces at the National Park and now they're preparing for their first game here at the Everest Cricket Ground. Amrita, how was the feel of the team right now as you're going to the, into your first game in the competition? We are excited and nervous at the same time. Well, nervous comes with the territory, I can tell you. I've been a comedian for years and before I go on stage, no matter what it is, the butterflies are there. So it comes with the territory and that's when you do your best, you know that? Yeah, I know. But in, um, today, you're, which, which team you're coming up against? Uh, fabulous. Reloaded. Have you ever play, um, played against this team before? No, never heard of them. Oh, well, in this competition, you might not hear about a lot of teams, but they're actually good. Okay. You witnessed the first game between the Green Warriors and uh, and the team that they defeated. Um, what were you, what was your thoughts on that game? I knew that the Green Warriors were going to win the game because we had a match against them, a friendly match, and they were like, really good. So you think that might be the team to beat in this year's competition? I'm not sure. I wouldn't say so. Or the Divas, um, they are the team to beat. Well, the Divas should definitely be the team this year. Well, that's your word. That's your word. All right, Divas, make some noise for yourself if you're ready. Let me hear the energy. Yeah. 